Hey, what's up? Uh, today, um, we're gonna go on a little adventure. Um, Royal Mail left a little message uh, through my uh, door saying, uh, you left the parcel. You weren't here to get your parcel. So we've left it at our, our, our collection depot thing. So I'm gonna take you uh, and we're gonna get this parcel because I have a very good feeling I know what it is. Um, I can't wait to see what it is, so I'm genuinely excited. I'm the type of person who orders lots of things online and then forgets about them. That's that's who I am. I order maybe like five, six things at a time um, and then two weeks down the line I go, there's a parcel here with my name on it. I don't know what that is because I order so much at one time and then I just completely forget about the things that I've got. I should probably look back at all the things, like uh, sites that I order stuff from and go, oh, well, that's expected to arrive here and blah, 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 blah. But I don't. I completely forget about it. And then whenever a parcel arrives for me, it's a surprise, which is the, one of the best ways to think about it, which is great. So going to go pretty soon to uh, collect the parcel. Um, if 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 I think I know what it is, if you are a Pokemon fan, <laughs> this will be really interesting to you too because uh, I've been waiting for this uh, parcel for maybe two, three weeks now. Um, and it's apparently, maybe it has arrived. I don't think, I'm trying to think if I've ordered anything else. I know I have the Sun and Moon English booster box arriving 3rd, 3rd, 3rd of February, so obviously it's not here yet, um, but there's something else that I ordered relatively close to the time that I pre-ordered, whoa, dropped the camera, that was close, <laughs> but there was something uh, I pre-ordered, or something I ordered around the time that I pre-ordered the Sun and Moon Buster box, and I think this is it, I think it's arrived, and I'm really, really excited, I cannot wait to show you if it is it. But before I do anything, anything, before I go and leave the house, before I go get this parcel, I need coffee. <laughs> it's not early, it's, it's, uh, it's, what is it, it's 10 to 10? 10? 10 to 10? Um, but I need coffee. I am tired this morning. Um, every day this week, for some stupid reason, I have been getting up at like 4 o'clock in the morning, um, like 4 a.m. for no reason. My alarm doesn't go off till 6 a.m. when I have to get up for work. But I've been getting up at around 4 o'clock every morning for no reason. For no reason. And apparently quite a few people have been going through this too. I wonder if it's the time of year or, I don't know, time shift, parallel, dimension, cortex something I don't know uh, but yeah I've been waking up at really really strange times like four after just ride four o'clock in the morning I've been waking up uh, and it's not cool because um, then I have I'm the type of person who whenever they wake up um, no matter what time it is if it's okay say 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 I woke up at four o'clock which I which I wish I did um, and I don't have to get up till six I won't go back to sleep I won't I will lie in bed awake for two hours until my alarm goes off and then I will get up I'm that kind of person. I can't go back to sleep. You know, I look at my phone and I go, oh, I have, you know, oh, just over two hours of sleep. That's really great. I can go back to sleep. Nah, not me. I will be awake the whole time. I'll be awake the whole time. I could just get up at four o'clock when I wake up. But no, I just decide to lie in bed. Just waste time. Maybe try my best to try and go back to sleep, but it never works. Uh, so I need coffee and then we will go before it shuts. Look at the difference in the sky. Package acquired. I got it. It even says what it is on the outside of the box, so I know for a fact what it is. Oh boy, I'm excited. I hope you are too. Now for the long trek home. Yay. Well, long. 15 minutes at most. Uh, but 
still long when it's this cold. I, uh, I just had to give somebody directions to the post office, which is usually straight down that road. You can't miss it. We are home. Um, that was a very cold walk. Uh, <laughs> uh, but I have... Uh, I don't really want to show you my address. Let me see where it is. Okay, you can't really see it. But it says on the box... Trading card box. Hmm, what could that be? Uh, it also says on the box, where is it? Da, 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 that, um, well, it comes all the way from Osaka in Japan. Um, and it costs about 800 yen, uh, which is, uh, let me think, let me do the math, about nearly $40, which is. Uh, right about the same in, in, in Great British Pound, uh, because currency is shit at the moment. Um, but it's finally arrived, and I cannot wait to show you what it is, because this proves that what I thought it was this morning is it. So, uh, I'm gonna get the, uh, the box open, and then show you. Well, guys, are you ready? It's finally here. It finally arrived. It took three weeks to arrive. Um, but it's finally here, and I'm so excited to show you guys. This is what I've been waiting for. Ta-da! It is a Japanese pretend Pikachu uh, Team Skull Grunt Box. Um, and I'm so excited to open this for you guys today. Look at all the little Pikachus in the this Team Rocket. Ah, oh, so cool. Uh, Team Flare, oh man, it's such a cool box. This is a Japanese release uh, from the Pokemon Center. It's an official box. Um, so if we take a look at the bottom, there is all the little, uh, all the little Pikachu's, all the little Pikachu's and little cool suits and stuff. Uh, nothing on the sides. This is the back. This is what you get in the box, and I'll show you in great detail at the top because it shows you bigger pictures at the top. Uh, but you get six. Uh, booster packs. Um, this is the box that it comes in. Um, some sleeves, a little box to keep stuff in, and I'm going to show you what these are very soon. Uh, I'm excited. But uh, if you didn't know, um, in Japanese booster pack, booster booster packs, should I say, um, you only get a certain number of cards. I believe five cards in a in a pack. Um, but I'm still excited because they're all in Japanese. Also, uh, I have a bit of a confession to make. Um, I haven't played all the way through Pokemon Sun and Moon. I know, I know I'm super sorry. I, I, I've let everybody down. Um, I'm a big Pokemon fan, but I have not had time to play through Sun and Moon. So, there will be Pokemon... On these cards, I know quite a lot of them from watching uh, a couple of unboxings of the pre-release of Sun and Moon. Um, but there will be maybe some Pokemon that I don't know. Um, and I'm sorry about that. Uh, I will try and guess them. I will try and remember them. I will try not to take too much of your time. But this is really exciting for me. This is really, really cool. It's still in its plastic. So um, it's, it's like fully legit. It hasn't been opened. But... The main reason why I got this box, are you ready, is for the two Pikachu promo cards that you get in it. Look at them! Look at them! They're so cool! Ah, so there's the uh, closer ver close up version of what you get. So you get six Sun and Moon booster packs, you get the box itself, uh, you get some sleeves to keep your Pokemon cards in, a little box to keep your Pokemon cards in, and then finally you get the two promo Pikachu cards, which are immediately going into sleeves, because I have uh, my 20th anniversary Pokemon sleeves sitting right here, so they're going immediately into Pokemon sleeves. So let's get this bad boy open! Alright, I got it out of the plastic wrapping. Here is the, the plastic wrapping that it, it came in, um, but I kind of don't want to take everything out of the box without you guys seeing it along with me. If you have not seen this before, 
um, prepare yourselves. I have seen what's in this box. I don't know what the Pokemon cards are inside it, uh, inside the booster packs, but um, I know I've seen everything is in this box. Um, but I'm still so excited to see it in real life. It's so cool to touch. So if we slide off the uh, the cover on the top, if I can get it off, there we go. And there is the box. That's the box you get, and it's really cool. Um, let's see, uh, Pikachu's. Uh, it says Pokemon card game on the side. Um, so are we ready? Are we ready? Are we gonna get it open? Are we gonna open it? Are we gonna open it? Oh boy, here we go. <sighs> oh my goodness, there we go. Wow, so there is the, uh, oops, there is the, um, the six booster packs of Sun and Moon. Uh, these are some sleeves that you get in the box. I don't know if I'm gonna put the cards in these sleeves or my 20th anniversary ones. All the rest are my 20th anniversary. Uh, there's nothing there. This is the little box I think you get. Ugh, you get with it, yeah. It's the little box, which I think has uh, dice in it. Let me see, let me set that up there so you can kind of see it in the corner. Let me uh, open this real quick. Sorry if the sound is terrible. Um, there we go. Um, Let's see. Oh, it's a little Velcro. Oh, yeah, it comes with uh, card dividers. There we go. There's little card dividers to keep your Pokemon cards separate, and you keep them in this neat and handy little box. But this is the reason. This is the reason why I got uh, this box. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba! Look at that card. It is a uh, Team Skull Grunt Pikachu. A pretend Team Skull Grunt Pikachu. Let's open it up. Real quickly. Oh, before I do that, uh, let me get my uh, my two sleeves out uh, because I don't want any harm to come to these. Um, let's see, is it one, two. Yes. All right. So look at the back. That's the Japanese back of Pokemon cards. Very different to the UK and our European and English releases and stuff. Um, very different card backs. But oh my. So here we go. There is the Pikachu card. Team Skull Grunt Pikachu. It's really, really nice. Uh, and then we have the team, the full team of all the uh, evil Pikachus. <laughs> you have Team Skull, Grant there, you have Team Rocket, um, you have Team Flare. Yeah, all of them. All of them are there. And it's such a nice card. The foiling on this card is excellent. And it's all in Japanese. Um, which is really, really nice. 80 health on that one, 60 health on that one. Um, really, really nice card. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, put these, uh, where is the top? There it is. Put these in sleeves, because then, then that way they will be protected. There we go. They are in sleeves. So no harm can come to them. They're in my uh, 20th anniversary sleeves. Uh, which I love. I love the 20th anniversary Pokemon set. There's the other sleeves uh, that I've showed you. Uh, I will be keeping them for something. But we are here for these. Uh, now, I have to be very careful. Yeah, there's five cards in each pack. So three uh, Sogaleo and uh, three Lununa uh, packs, each containing five cards each, because uh, that's the way they do it in Japan. Um, but the way you have to open them <laughs> is by scissors, um, because they make it very hard to open them in Japan. I have to make sure that I'm not going to cut any cards. Now, in the Sun and Moon uh, cards, there are no longer EXs. Um, EX cards are no longer a thing. Uh, they are instead GX cards. Uh, so I think we will do it... Um, like this, we will do uh, sun, moon, sun, moon, sun, moon, um, just to get a, a clear um, difference of cards. So here we go. Um, but yeah, there are no um, are no EX cards. Now, I don't know which way, I don't think there's any point in swapping these around um, because it's not the English uh, booster packs. There's a, a trick to do them. But if, if you don't know, if you are getting sun and moon, booster packs when it was ex cards 
Um, this is a little handy tip for anybody who are planning on getting Sun and Moon cards. If you got like evolutions or you know generations stuff like that, um, it the card trick was always three two, right? If you if you if you do this, um, the card trick was always three two. Uh, for Sun and Moon, um, it's four two because each pack has a energy card in it, but on the front of the pack, uh, like usually down here where it said it would say ten additional playing cards or whatever game cards, um, they don't count the energy card. Uh, so you technically have eleven cards in a pack, um, but there's only it says ten on the front of the pack. Um, so that's a little handy tip. So you do four two and not three two when it comes to sun and moon cards. So here we go. Oh boy, uh, I believe this is a herdier. Herdier, I think. Oh, we have something shiny. Oh boy, the first car, first pack. I'm so excited about this, guys. You have no idea. So it's Herdier. We have a Psyduck. Uh, I love the art in the Sun one. So every, the artwork on these cards uh, are the same artwork, I believe, on the um, the English versions of the cards. So every artwork card you see uh, is the same. It's the same artwork you'll see on the English versions. So Herdier, Psyduck, uh, Lillipup which is adorable, uh, and oh my god, wow, um, I believe there are three, that's going into sleeve right now, just give me a second, there are three, um, three, uh, kind of rarities when it comes to, I can't believe I pulled a Salgao, uh, card in a Salgao booster pack, I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that terribly wrong, but there are three kind of rarities when it comes to uh, GX cards. You have the normal GX, you have the, uh, which, uh, which some people go uh, rarity 1, rarity 2, rarity 3. I believe this is a rarity 2. Um, I believe so. I think it is. It's a rarity 2. A rarity 3 is a lot more uh, shinier and silvier and there's less color on, on the Pokemon itself. But I cannot believe... I pulled that. Um, wow, that's really, really cool. First pack. Wow. Uh, <laughs> can't get out. You're going to go over there beside the Pikachu. So I'm going to keep uh, you all back here so you can all see them. Uh, so here we go for the next pack. Wow, I cannot believe I pulled that. Um, I didn't uh, say the last card in, in that pack because I can't remember the name. Uh, I'm so sorry. Am I going to open this? Oh, okay, it's this way. Um, wow, here we go. Uh, yeah, can't, I, we have another card. I don't believe this. We have another card in this pack. Is this set up? <laughs> Is this crazy? Um, I don't know. I cannot remember. This isn't... Oh, I can't remember the name of this card. I'm so annoyed. I don't remember. Uh, that's a, a Togu Mega Neo or something. I can't remember. I'm sorry if I'm butchering the names. I'm sorry. I have not played all of Sun and Moon. Um, but I, I know the Pokemon, I just, I just can't remember the names. Uh, there we have, uh, Drowsy. Uh, oh boy, what is the next card? I am so excited for this. It is... Oh, yay! I can't remember the name of that. <laughs> but, uh, um, yeah, I know it's a good card, uh, and it will see a lot of play, um, because of its moves. Um, and then we have, uh, Big Malasada as our trainer card. Um, which is nice. So this gonna go in. I think we should take out a lot more sleeves now that I think about it. So this is gonna go into a sleeve as well because it is a, a special card. There we go. Oh, you're gonna fall. Let's not. Let's not do that. Let's uh, set you there so you're safe, kinda. All right. Oh boy. Two packs in. Four more to go. Here we go. Um, let's put that down there. All right. We have an Alolan Meowth. We have a Paris, Shelder, and a. <laughs> I love this card. It's an Alolan Dog Trio. Uh, and it just reminds me of Hansen. <laughs> they just remind me of Hansen all the time. Mm -bop. Um, just that hair is uh, it's just crazy. Uh, and then we have a, a Golbat, um, which is super sweet. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm keeping this because uh, I might even frame it. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's such a funny card to me. It's such a funny card. I don't know why they did that. Um, or even made it look like an Alolan, or made it look like uh, Hansen, but they did. Uh, we have a Surskit, we have Snubble, we have Spiro, we have a Nest Ball, I think, and we have a Toucanon, which is sweet. So nothing really special. We have pulled three cool cards in, in three packs. So that was number four. We didn't get anything from that. Uh, so um, let's see if we can get anything in this. I don't think, I don't believe we will, but there's always hope. Uh, I don't. Bon Sweet, I think the name of that is. Oh, there's an Eevee! We pulled an Eevee. That, I don't even know. I don't even care um, if that's not shiny. Uh, but Eevees are adorable. And um, let me just put these here so they don't fall. Uh, we have uh, How. And then we have Beware, which is super sweet. Um, let's go for the last pack. Oh, and there's something shiny in this. I let my finger slip, sadly, but there's something shiny in this too, which is really, really exciting. Last pack, let's get something. Let's get, hopefully, a rarity. Either a rarity one or a rarity three. I would appreciate them both. I cannot believe our first pack we pulled a Sogleo. That was amazing. Uh, Poliwag. Uh, that's the evolution of Pickyback, but I can't remember its name. Uh, Rock and Roller. Uh, oh, we have, yeah, the evolution of Rock and Roller, or the final. Um, I can't remember this name either. I'm so sorry about this. Uh, and then we have Charger Bug, uh, which looks like the Magic School Bus, in my opinion. Uh, <laughs> but there we go. That is uh, the Japanese uh, Sun and Moon Booster Pack openings. Let's take a look at the uh, cards that we got. So we got this one, which I can't remember the name of, I'm sorry. We got that super cute Eevee. I cannot believe we pulled this card. Sogaleo. That's such a cool card. Uh, Alolan Dug Trio. And then we got the two uh, promo Pikachu um, cards that we got with the box. So I hope you liked the box. I'm sorry that I don't know all the names. I am super, super sorry. I will learn them before the uh, English version comes out. Or even when the English version comes out. It's obviously going to be easier for me to, uh, to understand them. Uh, but there we go. That was super cool. I really really enjoyed that. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video too. Um, apologies again for not knowing all the Pokemon. I might just go ahead and play Sun and Moon right now just to make sure I know Pokemon names. Um, but if you liked the video, please like uh, and subscribe um, and all of that and I will be back again. Bye!